Good evening everyone, welcome to another video and if you're new hit subscribe down there below right now, it's absolutely free and ring the notifications bell so you don't miss any other videos. Tonight I have for you, this is my fourth night in a row, I have a game, it is the FA Vars first qualifying round and I am off to the Asprey Arena to watch OJM Black Country FC against Rochester. Uh, Black Country, sorry not Black Country, I think OJM Black Country used to be called the Black Country Rangers. Apparently there's something about it in the programme tonight. I will check it out when I get there if I get one. So forgive me if I say Black Country Rangers, but the OJM Black Country play in the West Midlands Premier Division, which is the 10th tier of English football, and Rochester play in the Midland League Division 1, which is also the 10th tier of English football. So similar level should be evenly matched should be keenly contested looking forward to it see you at the ground and roll the intro oh. here is a magnificent ground Terrible traffic on the M5 and the M6. I've literally only just got here. So I believe we have Black Country FC in the red and black, and Rochester in the all blue. And away we go. Right, even though we've had that early goal, I will try not to let that influence my prediction, but I was going to go for, just for a bit of fun, I was going to say Black Country 3, Rochester 1. So, we'll see what happens. Rochester have got the 1 already. See if Black Country, uh, Black Country get the 3 I've just predicted. Indirect free kick in the penalty box. Not sure what it was for. <laughs> oh. Come on, come on. 
This one is rapid. Done him brilliant. <laughs> The team playing out from the back. Doing Rob. Half time is OJM Black Country nil, Rochester one. They scored with their first attack, and it's been quite an even game. Both going at each other. Don't remember the home keeper being overworked much, and neither the away keeper. Black Country have had their chances, they just haven't put them away. Now, I have heard one of the away players say, Come on, Roaster. So if you are a Rochester or Roaster fan, let me know in the comments what it is. So we've got some subs. And we can sort his board out. Yeah. Oh, 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 o
Jesus. That's what I want. So full time OJM Black Country nil, Roaster one. I'm going to go with Roaster, Roaster because that's what I heard one of the players call them. So good game. Just regarding the name change I mentioned at the beginning of the video, the OJM, it is in loving memory of Oliver James Mee. He was brutally murdered apparently in 2007 and... Adam Sean and I, Fraz, chose to remember him in a way they knew he would appreciate through football. So that's where that comes from. Very nice touch by the club. Anyway, on to the game. That very, very early goal in the first or second minute, I'd say it was from Roaster. Good finish. Put them in the lead. And then the second half was very even. Tudum throwed. Black Country had chances to equalise, but just couldn't quite take them. But the second half, well... It was an onslaught from Black Country. Um, Roaster just sat back, defended for their lives, threw their bodies in the way. Black Country pushed a lot of men forward, had chances to lump the ball in the box. They didn't always choose to take it, so credit to them for that, trying to play the right way. They got through with that one-on-one -on -one near the end, when really the striker probably should have scored, but the keeper made a good save. And all in all, Roaster defended very, very well. And Black Country just couldn't get that final ball or the final finish. Just didn't happen for them tonight. So congratulations to Roaster into the second qualifying round they will go. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please hit like. 
and leave your comments below. How on earth did Black Country not score a goal tonight? You tell me. Remember to hit subscribe down there right now. It's absolutely free. Ring the notifications bell so you get told when a new video comes on. And I will be back next week, I believe, on Tuesday or maybe possibly Monday. We'll wait and see about that one. But certainly Tuesday, we are returning to Fairford Town to watch their FA Cup second qualifying round game. So until the next video, Monday or Tuesday, whenever it may be, thank you very much for watching and good night.